Really? Now you start snowing? Welcome back, everybody. I just actually uh, just got to the campground. I hopped back in my truck. We were in some uh, kind of nasty weather the last two nights. Um, yesterday, it snowed like crazy. We got about a foot of snow. And then last night, it rained, which melted a bunch of snow. And it rained all the way into this morning, and now it's snowing again. I just got out. I have a plan for supper, but I'm not sure how I'm going to make it yet. I definitely do not want to be making it in the snow, considering what we are doing. So I'm going to see if I can drive around, um, maybe find a different spot, set up shop, and uh, I'm going to camp right here, but set up shop, make some food. I'm pretty excited for today's meal, and we're just going to have a relaxing night uh, in the campground in a crappy, sluggish uh, spring, winter day. It's definitely a sluggish day, but we're out here camping, and we're going to enjoy the night either way in the truck, so... Thank you guys so much for coming along. I greatly appreciate it, and uh, I'm very excited to eat. So, I'm trying to find a spot and start cooking. Alrighty y'all, I ended up finding this nice little pavilion out of the snow, out of the wind. Um, snow is coming down pretty good right now. It's probably hard for you guys to see, but it's coming down. It's supposed to rain some more and uh, I even think it's supposed to snow some more this afternoon. So it could be interesting tomorrow morning to see what we got. But anyways, I'm gonna get cooking. I brought everything in here. I'm gonna get the oil in, start cooking tonight. I'm super excited. I'm gonna try my crack at some fish egg rolls. Got some perch right here. My daughter's ended up helping me catch some. Um, I caught these a couple weeks ago. Good job, keep reeling, keep reeling. <laughs> keep reeling. <laughs> Good job. Got a perch. Good job. All by yourself. Good job. <laughs> oh, let me see my fish. I caught. Daddy, a fish! I caught. Daddy caught it for me. Good job. Uh oh. Daddy, it's a really stop. big one. Oh, no, Sophie, I want it. No, we. Good job. froze them and now we got a pile of flays. Try making some egg rolls. Got the egg roll spring roll wraps. We're gonna throw this together here and uh, see how it is. Got my fish cut up here. I don't think I've ever had this, but I'm gonna put some Slappy Mama seasoning on there. I'm gonna coat these very well. I like some spice, so I'm gonna thoroughly coat these. I'll take it from that plate. I'm gonna dump it right, right in here.
Next, I take some slaw. Pour a decent amount of that in there. Put the lid back on here. Give it a big shake. See how this is shook up. Oh yeah. It's gonna be good. I've never actually rolled egg rolls, but we're gonna give it a try. Egg roll slash spring roll. Some mild cheddar. Throw us a little, little cheese down first. Snow needs to stop. It's getting everything all wet. It's hoping to stay out of it. Get us a decent little portion in here. Like I said, I've never, never rolled them, never made them. It's probably good, I think. good but it's just a little guy wet my finger get this wet just fold it right back over just like that it's got a little little fish pocket Prettiest one so far. Definitely not the prettiest egg rolls I've seen, but honestly not terrible for my first time. Just a little short. They're about done. It cooked really fast though, so I don't know, I'm gonna have to check. Voila. Put a couple of these in here for now. Keep them warm. I hope these are done. They cook pretty fast. Alright. For the side I got some Sweet chili sauce. Oh yeah, that smells good. Try that. Alright. I'm super excited to try this. Hope it's done. white flaky meat that is so good mm. Mm -mm -mm. you can definitely taste that slap your mama seasoning gives it a nice little spice 
sweet chili sauce, a little sweet flavor. Oh, super good. Fingers are definitely starting to get a little chilly. Whew, snow is still coming down. Thank God for this balcony. We were able to use this as some cover from all the snow when I was deep frying. So anyways, I'm gonna finish these up, throw everything in the truck, and then head back to camp, and uh, I'll see you guys shortly. Mm -mm -mm. All right, just made it back to the campsite. I got my leftovers in this little container here. First time ever making egg rolls. First time ever trying fish in an egg roll. And uh, it was very good, not gonna lie. It was a big hit. One of my favorite ways I've ever had my fish. And that says a lot, because I've made a lot of fish. So yeah, definitely recommend giving it a whirl if uh, you guys like fish and egg rolls. Yeah, this weather is not letting up at all. It's uh, snowing pretty good out there yet. I don't know if it's supposed to warm up and switch to rain again or not, but the way it's coming down, we're definitely gonna have some snow in the morning on the truck. I stopped at Walmart on the way. I ended up picking up a little ceramic heater, a little digital heater. I'm gonna give it a whirl tonight. I'm just kind of curious to see how well this thing will actually heat my truck up. We are in a site with electricity. Um, I'm gonna run an extension cord through my door and we're gonna give this little guy a shot. I mean, why not sleep in a 60 degree truck if we can instead of uh, waking up and having to be 20 degrees in here. Actually looks pretty nice. I'm gonna have to plug this sucker in and see how she goes. See if she'll heat the, the old truck up. Oh, my bed's looking pretty comfy. Gosh dang, she goes all up to 95. We'll see. That sucker might put out some good heat. Well, she shut. Oof. Cord is kind of big. Yeah, she shut. in here for a bit. Nasty out there. Nice and cozy in here. We'll find us a movie to watch. Oh, those got to get replaced. Luckily, I picked up a pack on the way. Oh, yeah. Perfect. This little heater is putting out some pretty good heat. It's gonna be cooking in here. Which I ain't complaining. She's cold and nasty outside. Finding us a movie here. I think I'm gonna watch Escape Plan the Extractors. I don't think I've ever seen it. Nice and cozy in here. I had to shut that heater off. It's getting too hot. As you can see outside, 
is still nasty and uh, it's gonna be getting dark here shortly probably turn that heater on here again after a bit something about just being out here out here in the woods in the truck i love it even if the weather is not nice which it's far from it today rain and snow just nasty cold and uh storms blowing through now and into the night so we're gonna tough it out in the truck like i said i got a heater i'm not too worried that sucker is for the money definitely worth it the last one i had is not very good this one was like 17 bucks i think and you can set it up to 95 degrees and it was cooking in here so anyways still full from the meg rolls kick back turn this movie on and enjoy it thanks for coming along i love y'all You look at that i got a little break from the snow all right starting to get dark i'm gonna pop the reflectix up on the windows and get everything sealed off all right guys i'm hopping in the truck for good tonight it's getting starting to get dark and i'm gonna finish up this movie just got the reflectix up and uh we are good to go That was a pretty good flick, actually. Escape plan. The extractors. If you like action and uh, some shooting, <laughs> it's a pretty good flick, actually. It's kind of nice having these lights on this LED strip. It lights it up in here just enough, and it's kind of nice for when I'm watching a movie. But yeah, that movie was a good, good movie. Um, I'm definitely gonna watch at least another one. It's only eight o'clock find another one here and kick back. I also got some uh, chips and salsa for later I'll probably be digging into, so for a little snack. Definitely one of the best investments I've made for when it comes to cold weather camping in my truck. Like I said, this thing was like 16, 17 bucks, I believe, and so far it's been running like a top. It gets it all nice and warm in here, and the Reflectix holds a lot of heat as well. Nice and cozy, almost too warm. Now I'm gonna watch Redemption. I don't believe I've ever seen this one either. I apologize, I can't give you more info on the on the video. And I didn't take a screenshot of the descriptions. I don't have enough data right now to go online, but I just downloaded these off Netflix. Let's pull my sleeping bag out, fall into that. Probably really won't even need it, that heater, but at least use it for a top blanket. Let's do that for now. I need plenty warm. I really don't need to be in it. There we go. Voila. Uh, got my fan in here for later, so it's not quite as quiet. <laughs> it's so quiet, but it's also peaceful. Tried to buy more film for my Polaroid tonight at Walmart. For a camp pick and uh they were sold out of the size i needed so hopefully, hopefully get them next time all right pause the movie kind of craving a snack cheers slept well i fell asleep during that second movie last night and i slept like a rock it was so cozy in here like probably the coziest it's ever been in the winter with that little heater it kept it at a perfect temp and yeah that's that's the ticket right there oh man tired but you gotta get home i'm gonna start packing everything up and start making our way home So nice in here right now. That's 
saying it's 81? No way. I don't know if it really frosted up too much on my windows either. See how much frost we got. No frost, just some condensation. Yep. Same thing. It's gonna be a nice day, I think. This heater is set for 79, and my truck is reading 80 degrees in here. And it's about 30 degrees outside. Man, that's nice. Definitely worth it. Little caffeine in my day. Little bubbler. Twisted exic elixir? Twisted elixir? It's only five calories. And actually pretty darn good. I like bubblers. 69 milligrams of natural caffeine per can, so pretty much like a cup of coffee. Luckily, I really don't have much to pack up. Pretty much hop in the front seat and take off. We didn't even bother with a fire yesterday because the rain we had previously and then it snowed and I didn't even grab wood. Probably could have had a fire yesterday afternoon, but oh well. Next time, we turn this off here. We can unplug it. It's got a little timer, it counts down. Yeah, that thing's cranking some mad heat. Start my truck. Try to get some of this condensation off the windows a little bit. Got my keys hanging right up here. Oh yeah. She's a little cold this morning. Another nice morning. Sun's not really shining yet, but Hopefully it's a nicer day than yesterday. It's only 21 degrees out. It's colder than I thought it was. And I was plenty cozy in the truck. But we're heading our way home and uh, I'll see you after a bit. 119 after like, it's like in Boston too, like Eastern time. spilled everywhere all right everybody just pulled into the driveway back home overall that trip was a blast uh those fish egg rolls were super good highly recommend giving them a try um this little heater i bought from walmart actually worked very well way better than i thought it would less than 20 bucks and this thing kept me super cozy and comfy for the entire night i woke up this morning and the sun was already starting to poke up and i had no idea I just slept like a rock. So overall, great trip. Uh, still pretty cold right now. It's in the 20s, low 20s. And uh, things are supposedly starting to heat up here in the next week or two. So yeah, we just got a blanket of snow uh, this late in March. Pretty crazy, but we had a pretty mild winter so far. So it's not too surprising. But anyways, be a lot more content to come. I love y'all. I greatly appreciate you coming along. And uh Y'all take care and I'll see you in the next adventure.